Hello and welcome back to Elf's Plays Quake 2 Call of the Machine. Last episode was extremely stressful <laughs> and made me nearly raise quick gaming forever. There's lots of X, like I don't think we would have had this many polygons in a level in 1998 to be fair. So they've used a lot of um, you know, the extra availability of, <coughs> excuse me, uh, of technology today. Not 100% sure how we ended up on the moon here. Oh, we've got health counting down, so we should make use, make use of that. Yeah, 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 sure. Um, we jumped through a portal after beating the world's most insanely difficult boss. And now it's given me some of the things that I could have used in order to do that boss a little bit better. <laughs> so, maybe don't let them. Don't let them just. Yep, like this. There's a reason they gave us this. There's a reason they gave us this, I suppose. Anyway. Stop that. Uh, let me go pick up some HP. <laughs> oh, our health was ticking down. What do you do? These, look, new boxes. Actual flight cases. That makes sense on the moon, I suppose. Yeah, <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, there's a whole bunch of my allies in front of me, so I just shoot anyway. Look. I'm pretty sure our own military have rules about this sort of thing. First, <clears throat> first of all, don't stand in front of somebody with live weaponry. And second of all, don't shoot live weaponry when there's somebody in front of you. This is two things. This is called a lunar outpost. And that's lunar with... The, look, we're on Earth. Yeah, we are. That's so weird. So the Strode must have set up some sort of basis, basically. Uh, that would be my thing. Uh, that we've been working our way through. I need the, not for the armor, I don't. You're a loser. So we are... This is an Earth-based... Mission pack. That's great. I, I hadn't realised that. I know it, there was clues, but this is the this is the most cluey clue ever. <laughs> Why didn't I get both of them? I should have got both of them. Well, maybe we just beam gun. What is this flipping? I haven't got a grenade launcher. See that? It's Alcatraz. Moon Kushas. At least we can throw grenades when there's no gravity. <laughs> what else have we got? Yeet. Ah. A grenade that does nothing is just so disappointing. Wouldn't you say? Well, maybe we use this. Ah, oh, I forgot that was there. <laughs> when I could see it, I was going, don't pick that up. And then, eventually it's existed near me. And I did it. All these doors shut? Yeah. Why did everyone who top? A little bit of tactical use of uh, <clears throat> one bullet at a time trying to drop him. It's stuck. Right now. Nope. <laughs> well, if an explosion can't do it, then I am all out of ideas. That's all I can do. <laughs> they both did the same thing. That's funny. Whoa! I tried to dodge it, and then I dodged past it, and then I dodged into it again. <clears throat> Fundamentally. That's what we call an epic fail. In, in the community. Ah, <laughs> yeah, you see. What? There you go. Good. We stop now? This one's stuck. Many are stuck. I wonder if there's a... something I can do about it. I just want to press E. Just tap me. Give me one of them quick time events where I just have to press the button really fast and use it to force. <coughs> mm, push button. Receive bacon. Well, it's the only thing to do, so. Boop. Ah. <coughs> oh, I have to excuse my coughing. I've moved the microphone a little bit closer. I've noticed. Oh. Hmm. I've noticed in 
previous videos that maybe it's a little bit quiet. Okay, no, there's a lot of these. Got the blue key, and therefore here. <laughs> oh, you don't know. Oh, what are you doing now? I thought I'd just use the super shot. Right. Still stuck? <laughs> yep. Maybe you can get through it from the other direction. Ooh. We'll just go in here. <clears throat> Secret. How many secrets? Four? I haven't found any of them. Well, now I find one of them. Do you know, I wouldn't have known there was anything under these stairs, so that's pretty good. Good design. I had not noticed that even the stairs were see throughable. Yeah, I just hadn't seen it. Surely they would have been glowing. Or at least given me some indication that there was something there. Got a Tetris. I like when. Oh, God. No. No, 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 no. Where's my dude? Oh, I nearly ran out of mouse room. <laughs> I like this sort of run around a bunch, and then there's a med kit there, so get that and then run around a bunch more. <laughs> Don't worry about, like, not taking damage. Take as much as you need, my friend. That's, that's a new form of ID game, right? It game. Do you remember when we just said ID and we thought that was correct? Ooh, this one opened. That one didn't. Do a little bit of explore exploration. Exploration. Uh, see if there's <clears throat> more secrets like that one, for example. Wait. Excuse me. I actually meant to press four. I don't know why I got my shotgun out. Now I'm trying to remember once again what game it was where the default weapon, you know, the one with infinite ammo you could fall back on was a shotgun. Because I'm sure I thought of that a long time ago, maybe at the start of the entirety of the Quake 2 series on the channel. Ooh, nice. Um, and now I just have no idea. you think this is um, accurate? Accurately... Let's save it. Uh, Gravity? What sort of moon gravity is there in real life? A loading data disk? But that usually... Signal jammed. Well, I was going to say, that's usually the end of the thing. Strobe jammers detected in moon core. Moon core must be a type of... It sounds like a... It sounds like a, an aesthetic, right? Oh, great. Haven't seen one of these for a while. I just imagine now just a bunch of scrog underground with their that head thing. <laughs> just trying to play their instruments in peace. Whoa. Right, I do like doing this. I got through a lot of that uh, ammo, and yet actually managed to basically kill everything. Which is surprising. Normally I'm way out of, <laughs> out of that ammo before anything. Oh, I did notice. You know how I said, hey, I'll come back to that um, secret and see if we find it on the way through? Yeah, it never showed up again. So, this, again, this seems like the sort of thing where that's surely the other side of that... Um, this, right? Yeah, it's stuck. Have a little peek around. <clears throat> doesn't look like there's a way into it that doesn't involve opening that. Um, there's no gap in the floor or anything like that. The other one had a clear gap in the floor. I just couldn't figure out how to open the gap. <laughs> Stuff like that, for example. That was a good secret. I'm a fan of finding that secret. So, you know... All comment below, please, on how good that was. Um, <clears throat> only in the positive sense, though, because it, it was good. Oh, jeez. Yeah, eight. Oh, maybe not eight. Someone else, someone else, someone else. <laughs> you. 
Probably don't have to wait for the weapon to stop spinning when there's literally no, no ammo in it. You know what I mean? Just put it, just drop it. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's important. You can pick it up when we finish. <coughs> He's mad slip, man. I don't know whether I, I don't know how I feel about the, um, what's it called? The phalanx. <coughs> Especially in these close quarters. Just looking for something to shoot. Um, to move to open these. Or maybe just like boot this, then jump off afterwards. Oh, there we go. This is a lot slower refire than it used to be, it seems to feel. <coughs> Take damage. Not me. The bad is. Why are you not dying? Alright, fine. Uh Why are you still alive? What the heck? I can get two losers. <coughs> uh, maybe machine gun? <coughs> Didn't expect those doors to open, if I'm being honest. I think you can tell by the way I behave. <laughs> my, my actions were very clear in that situation. Alright, low ground. Who wants to live for then? Just jump. Can I press it again? No. I kind of feel like I should be able to get up there. And find some seats. Let's go and see if there's some health. <coughs> it's going to be another one of them uh, play the game, upload it type jobbies. Because it's already gone midday. What time is it? Yeah, it's half past 12. So. I'll do. Oh, I'm so pleased to have found that secret. What's that then? Two or four? Because <clears throat> yeah, we, the the previous level or the previous part of this level, I guess, was uh, very linear. Well, what weapons do we want now? Oh, I haven't used a rocket launcher in a while. Seems a bit silly, but there we go. Uh, hello. You weren't invited. <laughs> Excuse me for all my creaking and coughing. You want me to go down there? What? That's definitely a secret, because it's exactly the same as the other secret. Well, <coughs> excuse me again. In for a penny, in for a pound. Oh, now I can it. Now I can shoot it. Seems okay. Each of these is presumably going to be a terrible thing. <laughs> Instead of just have to shoot them all. One more to go. Ah! If I don't explode this, something's going to come along and revive it. In another case of there's enough buttons to press all of them, <clears throat> how much HP do you think I would have lost there? But, uh, I only have to press them. Oh dear, here we go. There's, there's a third secret, a fourth secret, and I have no idea how to even have a look for that. Strop jams. Maybe we go back to the moon? Oh yeah, we would have to, wouldn't we? Because, transmit the data. Uh, okay. <coughs> Macron, oh, it's you again. Hello. This seems more doable. Let's just hide and all that. At least until... Why is Macron always hanging out? <coughs> Did he have a health bar in the original Quake 2? I do want to run through there and get that. 
But I suspect that that's probably something to leave. Well, I... What a novelty having somewhere to actually hide <coughs> in this in a, in a boss fight. <coughs> Alright, stop. I should use something else to kill them. I'm, I'm almost gonna, I'm basically gonna guarantee at this point this is a two stage boss fight. There's no way that this is it. First of all, there's a lot of space to hide. And so actually fighting the background at this point, it's like, this seems like a trivial part of the fight, don't you think? Compared to the end of the last episode, which turned out to be such a short episode because I cut out, well, you saw how much I cut out, 24 attempts it took me to beat that. Ow, you son of a... Ah, okay, well, okay, maybe if I just don't do that, that would make more sense. Um, that was just... That was just... I think I will use this, actually. I mean, compared to the mutants that attack me in that fight, <coughs> these flying dustbins are kind of ain't no thang. You know what I mean? Just gotta not stand in the path of a BFG, um, and you'll you'll be a lot better. It's probably better to tank the damage from them for a few seconds than to let this thing see you through the gaps whilst you're fighting them. Because the, the temptation is to stand still and shoot these, or even worse, run around and shoot these to avoid being shot by them. Whoa! Yeah, like that. Um, and then... As a result, you end up in the path of Macron, who then just owns you with a BFG. It's getting a little bit tricky, actually. I may have been a bit, a bit blasé on my opinion of the difficulty of the fight, but just, just get good. <laughs> just don't take damage. It's easy. Again, it's only the last HP that counts, right? I think there's something else might be in the back. Oh, Just hang out in here. Because uh, things have stopped rotating, so I can just be safe in here until they come back in. Presumably, yeah. At some point, <clears throat> whilst these things are attacking me or after I've finished clearing them out, I don't know. I have no idea what caused those to clear themselves. Let's use this uh, phalanx because, honestly, I hate it. And therefore, we should just use it up. It's like a spawn. I don't know if it's weirder to find that they have <coughs> given me stim packs, or that the stim packs actually seem to be effective in these fights. <laughs> what? Ooh, careful. That seemed like a bad opportunity to get wasted. I'm not in the fighting axe or but... Right. <coughs> Round B. Still got our invulnerability. I think it was important to have kept that. Because there's no way that was it, right? That was too easy, didn't need invulnerability. I only died the first time because I wasn't paying enough attention. Hmm. <clears throat> My throat is still a little bit... I want to say claggy. <laughs> Feels like claggy is the word to use here. 
uh, save it quick. Children of Macron. I've got the quad. I've got the invulnerability. You know what? Let's just use everything and see how we get. <laughs> One more to go. <laughs> this is insane. Where are you? Here you are. Baby Macron do the do. Baby Macron. What? <laughs> you gave me this power, game. Um. There's lots of explosions. Oh, that was it. <laughs> I got all but one kill, which was in... Which le what? Oh, give me back my... Oh, okay. I missed one in the previous level. What? That was just it. <clears throat> Fine. Uh, I did badly on secrets because that first one where we went in, I just assumed to be coming back and we weren't. All right, let's have a, let's have a new bloke. Let's, let's see what's happening. That was a fun episode, actually. Although I feel like that was supposed to be the lastest one, because I didn't do them in order. But then why would I do them in any given order, right? But let's do them in laser eyes. Laser eyes. That was, I, I, I'm so glad that I found that secret where you have to shoot the two other buttons before the ground opened up in front of you. Because that invulnerability. And then it gave me a quad damage in the thing. What's this now? What are we calling this episode? LG, CG, CG. Okay. He's a massage therapist in rugby. If you're interested. Look, there's no way this isn't a secret already. I'm gonna go over here <laughs> and see what the secret is. There's four. Whoa, that's neat. I like that. I see no secrets. There's an invisible wall preventing me from finding secrets. Ooh, secrets. Ah, come on. Okay. All right, all right. No secrets. Jeez, Louise. Okay, no. 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 Well, you tried. What are we doing? Locate entrance to security annex. Four secrets. Three goals. And a partridge in a pear tree. Right, um, how are you gonna, how are we gonna... Okay, 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 okay. Upset, but okay. Okay, we need to wander along there when we manage to get up there somehow. Presumably that is a place we're gonna be. Yeah, we'll be up there. Bit, uh, bit dead. Again, seems like a stroke fortress on, on Earth, maybe? Lots of these bridges in the retracted state. Oh, just a, gonna bait me with. I hate you. Okay, I'm gonna get you. Uh, get you. Aha! Aha! This looks suspicious, doesn't it? Just constantly on the lookout for anything that's a secret that's pretending not to be a secret. Hmm. Game saved. I haven't done anything. I've shot one bloke. This is such a disconcertingly quiet map. Don't feel like I deserve to be down. This is a secret, it's just a tunnel. It's just a tube. Isn't that where we just were? Yeah. Should we go in here without the rebreather on? Yeah, because it's just here. Hmm, hang on. That seems dodgy. Why would it be like this? Ah, even further to go. No, wait, what? This is just the other place. It's just connected up because it's good level design and you don't just have one way through to a place. Probably that's going to be a way to run away from something when we really, really need to. It seems weird that it's flooded. I don't think it's supposed to be flooded. I mean, it looks like ground that used to be not flooded. Can I go up there? Yeah. No. 
Yeah. Okay. Being excessively cautious. We're not just, like, wasted children of Macron <laughs> with many a shot. Ah. Interesting. Entrance is flooded. Ah, I told you. Look at that, puzzles. Puzzles in my platform. Quake too. I don't want puzzles. Get up. Leave it alone. Leave it, eh? Alright, where are we? Come on, CG. You and me. We're gonna... <coughs> it just means computer game, doesn't it? Alright, let's go through this door. Alright. Let's go through this door. Ah! <laughs> it opened. I don't want it to open. I was showing willing by trying to go through the door, but I didn't want it to actually... You know, put me somewhere and make me... Make a decision. Put my money where my mouth is. Don't put my. Uh, you have got some weird designs, you strong people. We're gonna pick that up. Seems a bit unnecessary to take 25 health to kill one missing HP. <laughs> run away, shoot, run away, shoot. Oh, nice. Helps me out. Stop it. And we knew that we would be up here, so we can now go down here and find our secret. Yay! What's that one? Two. Found two of them already, and one of them was just a pipe. <laughs> just a pipe that you're already supposed to have found. This, this. this doesn't seem sensible. This shotgun is bad. Game save. Uh oh. More flooding. What? Oh, the door shut on the. Okay. Oh, you have to. Okay, you can't. <laughs> it's completely flooded. You can't just go up. I'm gonna go in here first. I'm gonna. Oh no, this is fine. Oh, nearly. I'm trying to avoid using the rebreather because I'm fairly sure at some point it's going to be important that we uh, we're going to need it for a lot longer of a journey than that. Right, I guess we push this. Oh well. Ah. I feel like I'm going to need it to fill up again at some point if you don't mind. Right, how many of those? Um, all right, that's why there's a way out. How many of those secrets are going to be? You had to get them before <laughs> the water went. All of them. No, hopefully not. Hey! All of a sudden, you're a good shot, huh? Got lucky. I'm gonna call it that. Uh, here we are. Look, this is the the other pipe is still flooded. Why this? So we can get over the top. There we go. How does it look like it shouldn't be flooded? Can I say? I did say. Can I say? I think I picked up a machine gun, didn't I? I have to use it. Maybe I shouldn't use it. Oh, this is where the shotgun was. Right. I'll get in there. Just shoot that. Oh, there's a, there's a window. You put that there. Blue lasers deactivated. Hello. Hello. Look at that strafing. That's like the first enemy you meet in Unreal. You try and shoot it with the needler and it just moves out of the way. That's like, what do you think you're doing? 
What is this AI that can dodge incoming attacks? I think we'll have a bit more of an explore here because it's looking like we're getting to the end of an episode. 30 minutes it says on my timer. How about yours? don't care about yours because mine says 30 minutes. So, oh look, another machine gun. Magnificenter. Let's call that the end of the episode. That was much more successful than yesterday's episode. I feel a lot less stressed and a lot more benevolent towards the very concept of computer games in general. Um, and therefore, I think I will continue to play this game in the future. I don't know about you. It's quite good, I think. Ah, now you can't get it, you see. Yeah. Um, so, until next time. Thank you for watching this. Me playing a video game situation. Oh, okay. Uh, low HP. Right. Hurt a lot, but at least it died. Um, yeah, thank you for watching me play a video game that you could yourself be playing if you really wanted to. And I hope you'll join me tomorrow's edition of the same video game that I'm playing, even though you can play yourself if you want. Oh, I can still climb up here. And I hope that you'll leave a like on the video if you liked it, and leave a comment or two if you're up to it. And, oh, hang on. And, um,. I'll see you tomorrow for the next one. Remember to subscribe. Remember to join me on Discord. And remember to be a hoopy fruit who knows exactly where his towel is. Until I see you again. Bye.